morning, guys. We're going to jump into daily geography today, December 7th. Before we do that, okay, I do just want to show you a couple of things. One, last week we talked about the Robinson projection map, which looks like this. It has those curved edges, okay? We said that the closer to the equator you are, the more accurate it is. The further you get away, the less accurate. Well, now this week we're going to about the Mercator projection map. Um, you guys can tell one, I don't like this one necessarily more because I don't see the curved edges, but also look how distorted um, Antarctica is. Isn't that crazy? So again, this one, even the same, um, the further that you get away from that um, equator, the more problems that we have, okay? So let's talk about our question today. What is a projection, okay? We have a little bit of information down here that will help you guys. It's on your map um, on um, buzz as well. Okay. So a projection guys remember is just a system for mapping a round earth on a flat surface. So I literally have it right here. Okay. That is literally my answer up here. Make sure you put it in your own words though, please. Okay. Does the Mercator projection show the size, shape, or location of the continents more accurately? Again, we're going to read this down here, guys. So let me change my uh, color. The Mercator projection map shows the accurate locations of the continents and oceans. Okay. So the Mercator projection map shows the location of continents most accurately. Okay. Those are your answers for today. If you have any questions, please let me know.